Right, so that's the basic network building for trains. Now I bet you want to do some ship action. Yeah, probably. There are some nice there lakes are, with uh, a lot, lot of towns, so you can do some kind of packs uh, in lake action. You know, maybe up in the north, you see a lot of cities, towns on this diagonal lake like thing. I'm pretty new op operating the map. Okay, I'm still lost. Okay, so uh, look at the stream for a minute. Yeah. And here's okay. a station list. And you click <coughs> on the ships and it pops up. Click on the name of the, and there is the station or dock. Wait. Right? Um, so with this menu you can you can do all okay. kinds of things. I found it. Okay, so what do we want with this? Um probably passenger network on the lake. So we should go to the trollo down here. Uh yeah, could could work. It has a fair bit of range, so that's good. Yeah. So the first tip is go to the road construction, select some true going bus stops, and always okay. connect it to the docks. So this way, the dock has yeah, a decent more. coverage over the city. Oh. You wanna <clears throat> connect it with road? Yeah. Now we do ships now. Roads is another okay, story. So you, you want me to get focused on only one thing at a time? Yes. Because when we go deep into one kind of construction, then we can come up with the things that usually appears in any game. So I can tell you how to do certain things and you can learn it and then we can move on to the next category. Yeah, that makes sense. I will just go and build and... Yeah, I know. Every new player is trigger happy to place buses. <laughs> you have so many things to do. I usually have like two buses with the pure purpose of growing cities. Okay, so do we have any ships on this line? No. Uh, please rectify this problem. Okay, yeah, we have a new dock, but nobody is there. So I want to see the ships going out and doing stuff. Hmm. Yep. Uh, for such a... No. No, no, no. That's too far away. And usually, you should also separate them. So have one going there. Probably you can full load at uh, Stratse, and that's yeah. why you can have clone another ship of that kind. Um, and one direction is done. Now place down a buoy on the halfway and then send ships between uh, Tronlo and Manning Hill. So, like here? Uh, you, have, you have no choice, just one kind of ship. Alright. Okay. Go from here. Yep. There. Yep. No, 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 no. Uh, delete the second order. I, I could just add this. Uh, yes. And then you need to hit the buoy on the way back. So... Just like this. Okay. So it, we can start, right? Yep. And that's a city, so if you 
So money kill is pretty small. Uh, throwing low is much bigger. So if you clone a few more, because this is a slow as a snail, so you can get away with let's say three, two more, like so. And then you go to the orders and tell them to full load at strong low, right? So this way they will approximately separate each other, right? So mm -hmm. that's done. Now I see a lot of cities on the northern side. Also, um, not to mocking you, but. You didn't spread the docks in Stratsay to the city. That does that impact it? Yes, uh, because you increase the catchment area where he collects the passengers mm -hmm. from, and you so can encompass the whole the, city. Might want to add a bus too. You're gonna have a lot more packs on the docks, right? And that's a good thing because you can transport them. Yes. And you can there is a crossroad after the football stadium. You can put another one there. Wait. Uh, <laughs> just okay, hold I can connect it. Just hold control. Wait. Uh I have to remove it though. And that's it. Yes, beautiful. So basically we are covering the whole city. So it's gonna be much better now. So let's look at the northern part of the lake and add up those cities. Okay, so yes, indeed the coverage is basically perfect, but we can always increase it. There is no harm in it. Yes, really good. Okay, so you see the distance between Manning Hill and Great something something? Yeah. So basically that's the distance that you don't need a buoy. Everything greater than that you should have. I just wanted to place one. <laughs> yeah, you can, it's fine. But this is the distance that they can absolutely 100% guaranteed find. If you go further than that, maybe you should have a buoy placed down. Not, not, it's not always necessary. The ship's pathfinding is uh, good and bad at the same time. They can do wacky things, but usually they can find the destination, right? Um, the problem is it's, it's very limited. Okay. That's really aggressive. Uh, that's it, and at some stations. Yes. Wait, give uh, some uh, extra. The road. Yeah, you should give some extra coverage to that. Yeah, the road connection looks good, but not necessary. And another one, because why not? That should be good. <clears throat> yeah, and that's... So, in the base game, the spread station size is 12. So, if you see the topmost uh, bus stop you placed on, that's exactly... 12 tiles away from the docks. Okay, you have a, a lock there, really good. Now if it were for me, I would 
press down here the land so they can better pathfinding the ships are really bad in narrow not straight places and this was a diagonal and really narrow I think I'm just going to put the depot here I don't you can do that okay I understand okay I'll have this load, load full and just drop them all here I think okay uh, can you look at the orders of it yeah I'm looking uh, at the orders and why would you unload and leave empty just go there and leave it as it is okay so just visit the docks uh, and that's that's it okay and we probably need at least two of them now given that how rugged the coastline here um, just for safety reasons I would put the buoy there Get the you see, you don't want to see your ships strolling around in this bay by any chance. Okay, I and now that we have orders. shared orders, <coughs> then we can yeah. do before that go there, and after that go there too. Oh, okay, we both did it. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that's fine, that's fine. So I would put it on the same place. I just wouldn't destroy the river between the <laughs> to put a road there. But this this road is clearly going to help the city to grow, right? Because uh, the city tile is basically this junction tile here and the whole left side, right side is uh, restricted by the river but now he can go there so he gonna be happy uh yes indeed yes really good i think i'm going to do this to go to radberg and then to Man to the island yeah why not I see no reason not to. Also, if you look back old Trantal, there is a lot of passenger waiting for the better future. So give them options. Or what do you mean? Um, there is not enough ships. That's what I mean. <laughs> this is a hundred packs, right? So we probably need two more ships over there okay one ship here uh, going there 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 wait what what uh, oh the the buoy there yeah and after that he should go back to so between the last order and the first there is quite a big gap so you either put down a we somewhere here or just make it go back or, or use this one or even use that one if you have to i mean they, it's probably gonna find there it's just for the sake of learning things. Right? Okay, so... Right, okay. So, now I give you another task. I want to connect running the door to old Trondhal via ships that's okay um, I think I would be the canal I think yeah you are not allowed to do canals 
you have to go on the ocean as in real life <laughs> uh, 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 uh. no road no roads are allowed <laughs> you have to ship it so you can go with the unrealistic version which is digging here or you can go with the more realistic version and dig here right yeah and then if you really want to be cheeky <coughs> you build a bypass here yeah uh, put down a buoy over there uh, this one here so now it's in the city you can just extend a little bit the catchment and we are good to go and build the ship and give them the road there and back I like these places for ship depots it's it looks a lot more natural or you can place even two and extend this jetty a little bit looks even more cozy and <laughs> realistic I mean I'm not really big on realism in this game but it's just not my playstyle but a little bit you know never hurts <laughs> okay do we have a ship coming this way looks like yes the good elf, uh, and yeah so okay so look at a little bit to my stream I show you how I would give the orders right okay. so go from here you full load here that's perfectly fine and then just follow along like click uh, click click on the way back click there and you don't have to you know move them up and down that's a little bit tedious and it's easier to screw up than to not screw up so and we can clone a few more just in case it's not a really short distance you can also add more connection to this new dock to great rugber or new seat hat or something as you think it's gonna be fine and yeah that's about the ships uh, really not too much to add to it maybe one more thing that we can connect Fintan to this whole deal here with with canals right so just put it here mm -hmm. uh, give them a little bit of extension uh, we can maybe even build a road for it like so and have a new ship here and tell them to go from there to there and that's all we need here and it will cruise back and forth on the canal so yeah really not much about this um yeah actually one more it is really a lovely thing and you barely need it is the between two slopes having an aqueduct which is barely used but it's quite a good one uh, I like it 